Good evening everyone, this is me Debasis for extra time obviously in a day from now both India and England will be facing each other in the all important third test which gets underway in Rajkot from February 15th uh, but, but the big issue of concern is that India will be going into this test match with an inexperienced middle order batter. Why do I say it? The likes of Rajat Patida, Sarfaraz Khan and Dhruv Jurel, the latter two in all probability will be making their debut in the third test match and if you, if you look at their experience, obviously Rajat Patida had made his debut in the second test match in Vizak, whereas Sarfaraz and Dhruv Jurel are yet to make their debut if they are indeed in handed the test cap obviously and, and that in itself will see the Indian batting order I means very rarely do we see an Indian batting order in a, in a marquee series uh, to, to, like England like the series that we are to be testing now against England will have three inexperienced players and and, when, and, and further to that if you take the instance of Yashwasri Jaiswal who has played only six test matches and Shubman Gill 22 test matches uh, that that looks a very very uh, inexperienced batting lineup uh, obviously the owners will be on Roy captain Roy Sharma uh, he is the senior most cricketer the captain of the side he has played 56 test matches and he has not been amongst runs so the, he will have a huge responsibility to shoulder being the captain obviously the star batter so uh, uh, but uh, when it comes to the middle order obviously it, it is very very low in experience uh, and and, it, and it, this is all because of um, um, the forced injury concerns uh, or KL Rahul we all know um, has not yet recovered he is 90 percent fit so he is still recovering at the National Cricket Academy uh, Virat Kohli we all know has um, pulled off from the series because of personal reasons uh, and Shreya Sayar is dropped uh, from the from the remaining three test matches so that in itself is a huge huge task for the Indian batting order especially the, the inexperience they bring in to the table with the, the, the likes of uh, Rajat Patidar, Sarfaraz Khan and uh, Dhruv Jurel. But then having said that of the big news, the good news is that all three of them has, has been consistent performers when it comes to domestic cricket. They have scored heavily in Ranji Trophy in first class cricket. They have also done well in the recently concluded um, unofficial test series against England Lions. So they will be bringing, that, bringing in that confidence obviously someone like us, Rajat Patidar and Sarfaraz come has both scored hundreds against England Lions um, and, and as far as the bowling is concerned obviously uh, with, with Sri Mohammad Shiraj coming back into the Indian Indian test squad it looks like Jasprit Bumrah and Mohammad Shiraj will share the new ball along with the likes of the three spinners considering that Ravindra Jadeja is very very likely to play to, to be back in the playing 11 um, obviously he has recovered fully from the hamstring injury he suffered in the first test match in Hyderabad and he, he bowled yesterday as well in in, in the during the closed door practice and he bowled today as well uh, um, Mohammad Siraj also bowled full tilt in the nets today and and so it looks like the India might might be going in with two seamers in the likes of uh, Jasprit Bumrah and Mohammad Siraj in that case um, uh, in that case Mukesh Kumar will be left out from the playing 11 and and the likes of Akshar Patel Ravi Chandran Ashwin and Ravindra Jadeja will form the spin bowling trio uh, as, as far as Ravi Chandran Ashwin it will be a huge occasion because he will be nearing the milestone of 500 test wickets and what an incredible achievement will that be when he gets to that milestone and, and talking about the Indian practice today obviously it was an optional practice session the likes of Shubman Gill, Jasprit Bumrah did um, miss the training session obviously uh, Shubman did reach the Rajkot uh, late, in, late on Monday night and, and Jasprit Bumrah uh, will be reaching Rajkot today uh, on Tuesday evening along, along, along with Devdar Padikal who has been added as a um, uh, uh, replacement for KL Rahul who in all likelihood will be missing this uh, missing the remaining three test matches if if he does not recover in time uh, and 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 also Akash Deep Singh who the Bengal fast bowler he will also be joining the Indian test squad in uh, Rajkor on Tuesday evening so um, it was an optional training session obviously the Momo so Shiraj was seen bowling full tilt and he was seen um, because he is fresh uh, enjoying the break from the second test match and and he looked to bowl full tilt today in the nets and he, he bowled to the likes of Yashoshi Jaiswal and Rohit Sharma and immediately after we finished his bowling in the nets Captain Rohit Sharma was seen having a long discussion with Siraj obviously the importance was on, on, on batting rather because the India needs runs from their lower order and obviously due to that inexperienced batting you need the contributions from everyone means uh, um, and, and also there were they, that Indian captain was seen having a long word with Kuldeep Yadav as well um, but uh, come, to, come Wednesday 
said uh, it is expected that the uh, Indian team will have a uh, full training session in the morning. Uh, as far as the England team is concerned, obviously the likes of Ollie Robinson was seen having a long go at um, having a long bowling session in the nets, um, uh, and the wickets also uh, as 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 far as social media posts are from the from the social media posts, it it is it is likely that there, there will there there are some grass being left on that the wicket looks a slight greenish tinge, uh, but there there are some dry patches as well so it it's, we might favor the spinners but then um, england might be prompted to go in with two simmers in the likes of uh, ollie robinson and james anderson um, it, it goes to be seen whether they leave out mark Wood or not uh, but then uh, ollie robinson did go did bowl for a long time in the nets today um, but as far as the and, and there were some concerns with visa issues for Rihanna Ahmed and Jack Leach, the left arm spinner has also been ruled out from the remaining three test matches. So England are also uh, very low on experience when it comes to the spin bowling department. Obviously, the likes of Shoaib Basir, Rihan Ahmed and Tom Hartley. Tom Hartley was incredible in that first test match in Hyderabad. But then the second test match, um, India did bounce back. The, 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 as of now, the series stands one all and everything to play for when the two sides meet again in Rajkot for the third test match which gets underway from February 15th. So that that's all for now. This is me, Debasi, signing out for extra time. Keep watching this space to get all the news and updates throughout this uh, India and England test series. Until then, good night. This is extra time. Extra time.